A lot of people have been hyping up this episode, and it's called Turnaround, so I have no idea what's going to happen. I am very curious. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with Tokyo Revengers episode 19. Let me write that down. Uh, last episode, we had the beginning of the Bloody Halloween, which is this fight that's going to go down between Valhalla and Toman, the Tokyo Manji gang. It was being overseen by some other big gang higher ups. And with that being said, there's no rules, no holds bar. We wanted to have some conditions and some rules. But um, Kazutora and Valhalla said, no, we're here to destroy Toman. So and we're about to, shit's just hitting the fan. Shit's about to get real. If this is anything like the last gang of Raw and Hanma was there as well, this should be quite good. Some crazy stuff happened last time. I'm very excited. I gotta jump into this. Don't forget, if you guys want early access and full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead on Patreon. Links are down in the description down below for you guys. Make sure to check that out. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know exactly when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Don't forget to follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated. Uh, Tokyo Revengers, episode 19, turn around. Let's do this. All right, here we go. Exactly where we left off. If numbers are to be ex as they expected, this is going to be two times the numbers for Valhalla to Tomon. Oh, throwing some hands. Okay, Pe. Do fool you? Oh, Draken is not letting that happen. But Hanma, I don't know if you can stop Hanma and Kazutora. Hanma versus Draken, one on one. <laughs> oh, my boy Draken. Oh my goodness. Yes, but I don't recommend you get in the way of this at all. <laughs> he said, pay attention. Focus on our fight. Oh my god, Takamichi, come on. Hit him with a roundhouse kick, do something. Oh. No. Okay, Mitsuya coming to save the day. Such a good, such a good friend. Such a good homie. Come on. I love Takamichi, but Mitsuya is so right. And you're a part of his division. Come on. Can't make him look bad. Look at him. Come on. Yes. 100%. Let Mikey do Mikey's thing. You gotta focus on these two big dudes right in front of you. Come on, Takamichi! Fuyu's here. My boy. Facts. 100% facts. Everyone's scared. Bro, you've gone through literally more shit than everyone here. You have to be able to do this, Takamichi. Come on, give him a clean one. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. That's my boy, Takamichi. That's literally what I'm talking about. Yes. He's getting gritty. He's getting gritty. Ooh. He's catching some, though. He's eating these. Draken vs. Hanuma. That was a clean gut punch. That's the one thing that Toman has to be worried about the whole time, because they are outnumbered. Two to one. But it doesn't matter for certain people. Damn, I didn't even think, because a lot of these guys are the older gang of Mobius. 
Draken is such a good vice captain. Vice commander, I should say. I firmly believe that, too. I firmly believe that. Oh, Manji Gang's getting their asses whooped. Oh my goodness. And then you just hear Takamichi scream. <laughs> yeah, he's not giving up no matter how much he gets his ass whooped. You gotta respect the resolve. You have to. And if you can inspire the other Manji gang, Sagamichi, I'll be so proud of you. Come on. Come on, guys. Look at this. Look at this little weakling. He's still going. Mitsuya with the save. If Takamichi can do this, come on, boys. Come on, boys. Damn, I got goosebumps. Takamichi's a real one. You're not alone anymore, Draken. Shouts out my boy Takamichi. Shouts out my boy Draken. Ax, he can go all out, not have to worry about anyone else. Oh my god, Draken! Oh, I want to make that my wallpaper, I swear to god. Man's got the brute force. <laughs> OP. I love how Takamichi says OP. I love when characters say that in anime. Mikey's chasing after Kazutora. We still haven't seen Badgie this whole fight. Those are some of the captains of Valhalla. Oh. Chonbo. Captain Chonbo and Chome. Maybe it could be Chome, but. Hit him with the backhand. Ooh! Damn, this is tit for tat, blow for blow. Look at this scene. That does make sense. They really don't give a shit. Not only is it a 3v1, but they're gonna use weapons, whatever they need to, to win. Oh, oh, Mike. Oh, 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 oh my lord. Oh my god, he just got blasted by a metal pipe. My man is not down for the count just yet. Oh, that's horrible. I mean, I get it. He, like, his mind snapped. He's not thinking logically at all. Like he flipped the switch. He's <laughs> straight to the temple with him on his leg too. Those are literally the nuclear kicks he was worried about. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh, I gotta watch the next episode right now. Well, very much what I expected in terms of the action, the violence, the grit. I definitely was not expecting Takamichi to impress me as much as he did this episode. So gotta give a shout out to Takamichi. Like, 
physically he's not able to do that much but mentally he's able to show his resolve to others really reminds me of deku from my hero and that's what a true hero does in a situation you know you can inspire others motivate others and i love how they were so down and defeated not only because they have the numbers disadvantage but because the other guy the majority of valhalla is two years at the minimum older so they're bigger stronger more powerful but then they said hey if takamichi can do this we can do this why are we being such bitches and we don't want draken to worry about us anymore so now he can go be unleashed and <laughs> draken oh my lord is that man a menace there's a reason he's my favorite character. I fuck with Draken so heavy. Kazutora definitely had a tragic backstory in terms of his childhood. I'm curious as to what he chose, like his mother's side or his father's side. He really doesn't remember a lot of his childhood, but very abusive father. Definitely, I agree with Hanma when he says batshit cray cray, because his logic is very skewed. You know, just because you're just because he's your enemy does not make you the hero by killing him. That's completely subjective, but it's OK. And I love how he was like, is that why you killing your enemy? Huh? Is that why you killed my brother? And then Mikey just flipped the switch. Literally, I knew he was just letting him hold him and, and beat him silly. Headbutt the guy in the back, lifted up. I don't I can't say the guy in the back. Chom, Chome, lift, headbutted Chome, fucking lifted up Chonbo and pile drive nuclear temple kicked Kazutora. He looks like he's knocked out. The only question I have is we still haven't seen Badgie this whole fight. And I need to see him because he is going to play or he did play a big part in the last version of this. So I got to see how this is going to turn around. I got to see who how this fight's going to go. I love this fight so far. I gotta keep going. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. If you don't want to wait for the next bunch of episodes, check out that Patreon. Four episodes ahead for early access. The full-length versions are there as well. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know exactly when I post over here on the channel. Drink some water. Be safe. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace.